Hey guys, it's Robert Kennedy, the third RK3. That's me, yes, and I'm here with another quick tutorial. A user asked how to change the subscribe button on a MailChimp form, and that's fairly simple and straightforward. So let's look at how to do that really quickly. You go to your MailChimp account, log in, and you sign up. You don't sign up, you log in. Hopefully you've signed up already. and here I go I sign in and once I get inside I will go to my lists area so I'll click on lists and then I'll move over to this button where it says stats I'll click on sign up forms and what I want to do is beside embedded forms I'm gonna click select and then I will see all of the different fields or areas in the preview area so the person was concerned about this button here they wanted this it to say something else so that's easy to fix if you go into the code down here now this code you can't edit at least not in this format you've got to move it somewhere else but if you go down in the code to the bottom where it says where you're looking for the button let me see where it is okay right here where it says uh, input type submit value subscribe you're gonna make a change right here so what you'll need to do is copy this and what I'm gonna do is paste it into a WordPress page so I'm gonna go to my WordPress site and gonna create a new page click add new and I'm just gonna call this one test page and then I'm gonna go to my text editor not the visual editor I'm gonna go to my text editor and you can do this with any text editor if you want and then I'm gonna paste that MailChimp sign up form information so I'm gonna go down and find where that button information is so it should be the line that says input type submit that's usually pretty close to the bottom so right here beside value I'm gonna write subscribe to my list okay and then what I'm gonna do is publish this page and once it's published I can view the page and see that it says subscribe to my list right there okay and that's it really simple to edit that form as I said you can edit your information in any text editor and then paste it into the place that you need to have it go in in Weebly as we met as I did in another tutorial you can paste the information there all right so that's it subscribe to my channel Robert Kennedy 3 RK3 builds leaders and you can also go check me out robertkennedy3.com or launching soon leapuniversity.com would love to have you check in there and get some of these tutorials there as well all right that's it lead with purpose perform with power